Yo guys, Hash from Boxing and Back with another video. So Demetrius Andrade becomes 30 and 0 and su successfully defends his WBO middleweight strap against Liam Williams. Let's talk about the fight. Demetrius Andrade, as always, starts very sharp. Landed a lovely overhand left that wobbled Liam Williams after like a minute. And then he went through the gears and he nearly got him out of there in the first round. Going into the second round, Andrade was finding the left hand more down the pipe and he dropped him with a simple one-two right hand, left hand down the pipe. Williams got up, recovered, not enough time in the round and then going into the third round, Andrade was lethal with his uppercuts, just whipping the uppercuts in and turning and pivoting. He was looking brilliant until he got caught halfway through the third round exchanging with Liam Williams and he got buzzed. And it took him a couple of rounds to get his senses back and William started to put the pressure on him but wasn't successful in landing clear shots. Andrade was still nicking the rounds. Going into the second half of the fight, Andrade was starting to slow down. He looked tired at the weight. He didn't look as strong as he did in the early rounds and Williams was just marching forward with reckless abandon, didn't care about defence. He was just marching forward and trying to pin Andrade down. He wasn't successful at doing that. Andrade moved, hold, negated his way through the rounds until in the ninth round where Liam Williams landed a beautiful left, right hand down the middle. Andrade was badly hurt. Andrade survived dug deep and did what he had to do to go through the rounds and then he's in the 10th 11th round and 12th he just nicked the rounds hurt Williams at the end of the rounds but he didn't finish him but um, all in all it was a very good performance by Andrade he was sloppy at times he looked tight at the weight he was fatiguing and Williams pressure got to him a bit but he did what I had to do he won convincingly but it wasn't a world of light a, a, a performance where people would fear that Hopefully he can get these mandatory out of the ways. And yeah, hopefully he gets the big fights. Golovkin's out there. Canelo's out there at 168. Charlo, Morata. Um, let me know what you guys think about his performance. Uh, who do you want him to fight next? Keep, keep, uh, leave a comment down below. And yeah, it's Hashman. Peace.